Uh, hi everyone. Uh, today in this short video I'm going to show you how to create a project documentation and not just any type of uh, documentation but uh, the one that uh, is used by the end user and that is the help file. So you always uh, need to have some uh, type of documentation uh, if you are going to sell something, meaning uh, the application that you worked on and uh, help file is uh, well, something like a standard, let's say, that uh, all applications have and uh, uh, that is always shown if, uh, for example, I use some application and I, and I just press F1 and something pops up, right? Some documentation. So uh, let's see how to uh, create a help file and how to implement it into uh, in our application. Here I have a, a empty VCL forms application and I will put some components, uh, it really doesn't matter, it's just for demonstration. For example, I have a button and a memo. And uh, let's say that this application does something, uh, never, never mind what, but uh, we want to create a documentation, meaning a help file for this application. Uh, to do that, we can use this uh, help maker. <coughs> it is a free application and uh, you can download it from the web. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new project and uh, create a new help file. Let's say my application help. <coughs> Next. Okay, so uh, he already uh, gives me some uh, some uh, captions for my help file. I can delete them or use them or add some others, that doesn't really matter. I'll just say finish and now my help file is uh, created. So uh, what I want is uh, I want to use that help file in my application. First of all I'm going to compile it. Okay and this is what I got. Okay, and uh, let's say I want to add something add after. It is a topic and it will be about this button, for example. Uh, numeric context ID, this is very important. and some description. Okay, and uh, I'm going to create another one. Okay. So I'm going to save this, compile again, and what I have here is a memo and a button. So what I want uh, is uh, when I select this uh, component, this button, and press F1, that I immediately get uh, this content. So that help file, help file will uh, open up and will immediately show me this content. And if I uh, select my memo object and press F1 to get this. Okay, so let's see what I have. Uh, go to help and um, my application help uh, is generated. So I'm going to copy it in the same place where my exe file is. And what I need to do uh, I need to add two lines. Uh, if you're going to use this uh, uh, CHM file, meaning uh, this type, then you always need to uh, include this HTML uh, help viewer and add this line also. You, you need to add this line manually. 
if you use C++ Builder uh, XE or uh, older, you only need to add this. Okay. But I'm using XE2, so I need this prefix also. So uh, when adding uh, these two lines, I also uh, I can uh, say that I use the same help file for the entire application or uh, I want to use, for example, a different help file for it for each form that my application has. So I click on my form and go to this object inspector and what I'll find is uh, this help file. And so let's see how did I call them? Okay. It's like this and uh, now uh, all components in this uh, form will uh, get help from this help file so uh, if I want to get help for this button I need to specify some uh, keywords or uh, context and uh, my button I'm going to say uh, help topics his context number is 170 so I'm going to paste it here and for this memo one hundred and eighty okay so uh, I'll run the application and now my button is selected and I will press F1 and uh, as you can see a uh, help file opened up and it showed me uh, the content meaning the help regarding my button uh, I can select a memo object and press F1 now I have the help or the description for my memo object and so on so uh, as you can see it is uh, real simple stuff but uh, uh, like I said it is a really necessity if you are going to sell some application because your end users always uh, need to have some kind of documentation that will help them to use your application. Okay, guys, I believe that this is uh, this was really simple and uh, like I said, it can be useful. If you have any questions, please be free to ask. Thank you and uh, see you next time.